industrial record of the National at your local cinema. First seen by the public at Farnborough, the Fairy Delta II is undoubtedly the aircraft of the moment. And the pilot of the moment is Mr. Peter Twiss. He'd been flying the FD2 at fantastic speeds for some time. But now he's off on the record-breaking bid, taking off from Boscombe Down. Two flights over a nine-mile course were made at 38,000 feet, seven and a quarter miles up. So all that could be seen was the vapour trail, as he streaked along at well over a thousand miles an hour. The record of 1,132 beat the previous best set in America by 308 miles an hour, 37 per cent. What a triumph for Britain, and for the double DSC X night fighter pilot of the fleet air arm, Peter Twiss. Afterwards, at a brief interview, he gave some personal details. Ferry's chief test pilot, Gordon Slade, is with him. Tell me, what's it like flying at such speeds? Well, there's no sensation of, uh, of wind at all. We're in a pressurized cabin, and uh, it's comfortably warm. As the speed increases, the temperature builds up. I imagine this is a job of teamwork, although you, in fact, were the driver. Yes, a very large number of people are necessary to, to uh, achieve this sort of thing, and uh, perhaps uh, two or three hundred people are involved of, while the operation is going on. The RAF played a very large part in it, and uh, uh, I was uh, the lucky chap who was in the cockpit at the time. And do you train specially for this, or eat a special diet? No, I'm nothing, nothing so spectacular. Hard-boiled eggs at eight in the morning, I believe, I've been reported to have said. We don't, uh, I don't drink in excess. I don't, in fact, smoke, but I'm quite a normal human being otherwise. Well, if a man who flies through the sound barrier and into the heat barrier at over a thousand miles an hour is perfectly normal, I am a grasshopper.